Hey Kiss Divas, it is your girl Tracy and I am here with a flexi rod show and tell tutorial whatever it is you want to call it i had tried one years ago and i didn't have the right kind of dryer so it took forever for my hair to dry and i was like this is not for me so i have a new dryer you guys and i will show you that um, in another video products that i used was from lotta body and i did a haul on this that i'll be uploading soon with coconut shea oils it is their wrap me foaming mousse it creates soft wraps defined curls and tames frizz it's for relaxed and natural hair i also use the moisturize me curl in style milk this says it defines curls tames frizz and adds moisture and brilliant shine it's also for relaxed and natural hair i absolutely love these products my hair definitely turned out super super soft the only thing that i would change if i had to do this all over i probably would use the setting lotion instead of this because this creates a very soft hold which you can see here and it's super super soft but i would have probably preferred for this style a little bit for it to be a little bit firmer because it is humid in southern california these days i honestly don't think i did bad for my very first one i do want to try this some more with some different size flexi rods and some perm rods now i'll have another go-to style instead of my braid out i will say that it was very hot under that dryer and you guys know it's in the heat of summer so i will probably be wearing these styles more after september October you know, when it starts cooling down in Southern California. This is something that you can do, you know, and take out overnight. My hair takes forever to dry. It takes forever to dry, so that doesn't work for me. And I don't like sleeping in rollers, so I don't even want to go there. I want to be able to sit under the dryer and be done with the style. That's me personally. Now, I did do this on air dried hair. I didn't blow dry it, so I do know that I would have got a more silkier look if I had done it on freshly rolled dried hair but I didn't want to add any more additional heat to my hair. So let's go ahead and jump into this video. Okay so I made my sections. They were pretty much different sizes. I tried to make them about the same size but the sections as you can see are pretty large. After I make each section what I did was apply the wrap me foaming lotion to the hair and just made that made sure that it was all the way through the roots to the ends of my hair next I took the lot of body moisturize me curl in style milk and applied that on top of it and I massaged that into the hair making sure that I got it through the hair and I used my Din Man brush after that to kind of detangle each section. That also helped make sure that the products were evenly through the hair and it helped stretch the hair because remember I air dried this before starting the process. Now I'm going to go ahead and add my flexi rod. So I put the flexi rod about an inch to two inches away from my scalp and I go ahead and twist it down the flexi rod. I did it this way because I air dried and I wanted it to stretch my hair while, you know, in the process of curling it, a two-in-one type deal. And then after that, I curl it to my scalp to add some tension at my scalp and lock the flexi rod in.
enjoyed this video if you have any tips for my next flexi rod set please leave them in the comments i appreciate and love all of you guys thank you so much for your support i will have the link for where i purchased my lot of body products from because i had a whole lot of problems finding this but i did find a website online so that will be in the description box if you are not following me on instagram please follow me there my name is kiss 77 just like here on the yt don't forget to like comment and subscribe i will see you in the next video bye